You know the reason why I've called you here? There is fire in the bush burning. And only you can save. See this woman here. The cartel has called her to hide into the store where my grandson is being treated. She needs to go there as a nurse and behave to kill my grandson. So he wanted he wanted to go to the hospital to kill. Mm. That was that was her plan. But, that was her plan. But it was her, she was arrested. She was arrested by Kinakamao and Riaga. After she was arrested by Riaga, yesterday, when Kamau went to give her food, she managed to escape. I don't know. She escaped how. But I told my son Riaga not to trust anybody. Now, she has a plan. She has plotted a plan to go and kill my grandson, of which I won't agree. I want this. Yes. First, Hassan kidnapped your friend, Kolo. You remember? Yes, yes, I remember. I've heard of that. Yeah. Her old son plotted that old thing. Now, you need to go back to the hospital first. Tell my son and the grandson to move out from there quick. And and how where will we go yet? We don't know the places. We, we are not even we haven't even paid the bill because the treatment has already started. We haven't Listen. even paid anything. Listen, this. If I leave you guys there, nobody will leave to see tomorrow. After what happened to this guy, even the cartel themselves are shocked. They are very, very angry at everyone, including my own son, Riaga. Now, you guys need to go and move them out of that hospital. Look for another hospital. Anywhere. But we're already owing the hospital a lot of money. How will you do that? How will, you, how, how will this be possible? Because we're already owing them money. Because they already started the pre-treatment today yes. morning. Yes. Listen. Those cartels are not playing. They will take your life. Even this guy yourself is very, very angry. After how she was treated badly with Riaga, she was supposed to get killed. She knows that very well. The kind of revenge that they have with you guys, I can't even explain. If those people managed to kidnap Polo and the crew, what do you think they will do to you guys? If they manage to catch you. I know. But how will you be able to do all this on time? Because I left Riaga there. Riaga is very stressed. I don't know even I don't have even any plans that I can help him. He's very stressed. He doesn't have enough cash to pay all the all, all his bills. So I'm very I'm very, very worried, even me. Because mm. I don't know what I what I will do after that. If if you if you're telling me that I should remove Riaga from you should remove the child from there to another hospital. How will you be able to do this? The treatment has already begun. Because we, if we take the child to another hospital, we'll start paying, we'll start paying another bill, which you don't have now. How will you be able to do this? Now, what you need to do is find a way. Because if you go the legal way, the criminals will check the record. Because you guys will sign out at the reception, you will sign for transfer. No, that is not what I'm asking. Eh? Eh? He's not seeing you. She can't. She can't see me. I brought her down here. 
with my power. She, she cannot do anything. She doesn't know what she's doing here. What is this place? Keep quiet! <laughs> What's going on? Now, let's see. Let's see. Yes? You guys should not go through the legal way. You guys should escape. Not ask for transfer from that of store. Because of the connection that these cartels have. This woman here, she was a DCI, right? Yes, yes. She knows every tactic that she can use to enter the battle store. She can show the badge. And she will be allowed. Yes, yes. To come to the room where my grandson is. I know that. That is why I want you guys to escape from that hospital. I will help you guys. I've always been with my grandson. Because I, his grandfather, live it in him. Now, listen. I've checked that hospital every corner. And according to the room where my grandson is held, down, one stairs down, there is a route that leads to the tunnel that will help you guys reach the another part of the road without even camera seeing you. This is the camera of that place seeing you. And now, Desti, are you listening? I'm listening. Because, you know, yesterday we tried, we tried some tactics and it was very, very tough because there, there's a lot of security there. Yeah, I know. And I can see they have very, very tight security. If you follow that tunnel, you guys will come out through the backyard. There will be nobody who will know that you guys were sick and being held to be treated in that hospital. And how, how, how about the small beast, the small beast that we have already given them to start the operation? Now, you guys should call it off. So you guys paid 35%, right? Yes, yes. The rest. 65 was still remaining. And how did you know that we paid 35%? I was there. I told you. I, his grandfather, live it in him. Desi. Yeah? Without a waste of time. Yes. If you guys doesn't save my grandson, I will not save Polo and his crew. Are you getting me? Yes, I'm getting you. So, should we save, the, should, should we save your, your grandson first so that you can save Kinakolo or...? Yeah. They won't kill Kolo and his crew because we still have this guy as captain. She will not be able to manage to run away from me. I have to treat her a little. But they, they have one, one of her child. Yeah. I know, I know. So this is the way we are going to do it. Let's see. Yes. We save the sun. Tell Riaga this one. Yes. Save the sun. Yes. Save the wife. Yes. Then I will lead you guys where Kolo and his crew is. Then we will save them together. You hear me? Yes, yes, yes. So, what should I do now? Now, you have to run. How will I go back? I don't know. If I even found myself here. How will I?